Good morning. This is the wise owl to coming at you from the city where I, the city where I live. Purgatory is real. Purgatory exists. There's a testimony I would like to share to you to prove to you that purgatory is a real place. Now, purgatory is a place where you go after you die if you're on the way to heaven, but not yet. Purgatory is not a bad place. Purgatory is a place where you are you are, that you are ready to go to heaven, but not yet. While hell is a place where you go when you're not going to go anywhere. Just by hell, you 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 damned for for eternity. You, you didn't you didn't make you didn't make the cut. But purgatory is a place you go to to purge away your sins. It's a it's a Latin word, a, a Latin verb to purge. So purgatory is a place where people go to purge their sins away. They have to clean their sins away. There's some suffering, yes. But then the good news is you go to you go to heaven. Some people stay there for a long time, some people stay there for a short time. Here's a story I want to tell you that happened recently. Today is Friday. Today is what? Uh, I believe the uh, the the eleventh. No, today's twelfth. I believe. But whatever it is, whatever happened was this. Today's Friday. Tuesday. Uh, about four days ago, Tuesday, my sister, husband, had a dream. He had a dream that he saw his mother. That his, his mother died some years ago. And she was a very strict Catholic. She would pray for, 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 she would pray for souls in purgatory. She, she does a rosary. She goes to church and does all her... She does everything. She, she's a very devout... A Catholic believer and she passed away now my brother-in-law my sister's husband had a brother who also died some years back and um, I'm not going to mention any names because this is personal I'm not going to mention any names okay but this is a true story that happened on Tuesday today's Friday Tuesday already passed you know that this Tuesday that already passed. And the Tuesday was the 9th. Today, I think it's what? I'm looking at my calendar. I can't see. Uh, it's the uh, 12th, I think. And what happened was is that um, my sister came to me and told me that her husband had this dream. That his mother came to him in a dream and told him that his brother was in purgatory and that he should pray a rosary for him to get out of purgatory. The true story, I'm telling you, it just happened. That he should do a rosary for his brother to get out of purgatory. Now, I myself, a couple of days before this happened, had his brother in my mind. His brother came to me in the vision, his, his face, but I didn't put the pieces together. But this morning, I did a prayer, and I did a rosary for his brother. After him this dream, I did a rosary for his brother to get a purgatory. But his mother came to him to do the, to do the prayer, not to me. But I did a rosary anyway. Whether he's going to do a rosary, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. My sister Kathy, I mess I messages I messages messaged I messaged her and told her that I did my rosary for him. And um, she said when she comes home t today, she also do a rosary for him to get him out of purgatory. Purgatory is real. The rosary prayer, the, the prayer of the rosary is real. The Virgin Mother Mary is real. This brown scapula also is real. If you wear this, if we, if we wear this brown scapula, when we die, if we keep all, if we keep the, if we keep all the commandments and everything, 
we will stay in purgatory a very short time. That's where I wear it. Purgatory is real. And this is my testimony to you that people do need our prayers. People are in purgatory. We may be, be get, we may go to purgatory. But purgatory is a, 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 a waiting room for people on the way to heaven. But sometimes they want to get out of heaven so bad, they need our prayers very badly. And my sister's brother's brother, my brother-in-law, is that person who, who needs our prayer. So if you, if you have a person that, that, that passed away, a relative, and they come to you in, in dreams, or you see them in your vision, in your third eye vision, it may be they may need our prayer. And one prayer they may need is a rosary prayer to get them out of purgatory. Other ways to get them out of purgatory is to have a mass offer up for them. You have to go to a church for that and ask for information. Another way to get them out of purgatory is to do the, uh, the, uh, the cross, to do the station of the cross, the, the, the stations of the cross, or the way of the cross for them. If you go to my Wise Out 2 site or subscribe to my Wise Out 2 channel, you would see my videos. Go to YouTube and look up Purgatory and you'll see many ways that I put that you can uh, pray for a person. You can, do the, you can do the way of the cross or the station of the cross. You can do um, a rosary for them. You can have, you can have a, 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 a mass offer up in their name. You should go to a church and or ask for information about that. Um, you can give you can give alms for them. You can pray for them and give the charity, and or you can sacrifice for them. Maybe you want to fast a meal for them. Maybe you you want to eat breakfast or lunch, but you but you have dinner or vice versa for a soul for a soul in purgatory. There's many things you can do, but purgatory is real, and this testimony came true. This is a real testimony how a, 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 a true Christian woman, whose mother passed away years ago, came to her son in a dream and told her son that, her, that his brother is in purgatory and, and, and a prayer should be offered up, a rosary should be offered up for this brother. This is a true story. And I won't lie to you. Now whether my brother-in-law, my sister's um, husband is going to pray the rosary for his brother, I'm not sure at all. But I pray one for him today on Friday. This happened on Tuesday, the 9th. And, uh, and today is Friday and this morning I did a rosary for him. And my sister Kathy's gonna do one today when she comes home from work. And I messenger, I messenger her and tell her I did my rosary for him. I don't know. But his mother was a very devout Catholic who did rosaries. And she came and let him know that her son, his brother, is in purgatory and needs a lot of prayers. Purgatory is real. Visions are real. And this is a true story. And I say, and I leave this to you in the name of Jesus Christ, who I believe in, who died for me on the cross. I say this I say in his name, Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. If you like this video, please subscribe to my, give it a thumbs up. This video is a true video, a true testimony that really happened. If you like this video and want to see more of it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my Wise Out 2 channels for more um, testimonies, more videos like this, and more other videos of a different nature. Share this with your friends. Let them know that purgatory is real. Share this video with your friends or family members. Purgatory is real. The rosary prayer is powerful and it's real. The rosary. The Virgin Mother Mary is real. Fatima is real. Jesus is real. God is real. 
Hell is real. Heaven is real. Share with your friend who could need this, who need this video, who lost a loved one. And um, this is my testimony. This is why it's out to coming out true from the city where I live and where I love to live. Over and out. Have a nice day.